we are on our way back home. It looks like maybe I placed my bag wrong. Oh. You guys are worried about peasant things like sunglasses. Well, good morning, everybody. It is Tuesday morning, and we are on our way back home from our epic trip to England. Katie fell cheerio. asleep in the cab. Chip, chip, cheerio. <laughs> Everybody's exhausted. It was a whirlwind. Oh. It was actually a fantastic trip. I'm gonna say actually, it was a whirlwind, but it was, <laughs> but it was perfect. Everything about our trip was perfect. However, we're leaving and it's a little bit cloudy. It was sunny the whole time we were here, which we are told <coughs> is not necessarily normal for England. So we totally lucked out on the weather. We're pulling up to the airport now, so we'll catch up with you once we're in the airport. It looks like maybe I placed my bag wrong because Ryan said. Oh, yeah, so you didn't notice that a big circle, red circle around the standing up bag and a big old X right there <laughs> and a big old green circle with a check and a sideways bag. Mom, well, you, didn't, you, didn't, you didn't, that didn't catch your eye? No, <laughs> no, I was over here messing with that computer oh thing. So now we had to seek assistance. It's supposed to be going right on. Yeah, so that's not Just happening. Push it over. Because like I'm sorry. one belt. Should I, I do that? See, see, see. No, <laughs> she needs help too. Another goes. Another goes. Should push it up and down. And we just pushed it over. <laughs> go baggage, go. Oh. <laughs> okay, Brandon, let's see if you can do it right. Hey, I did it. Nice. Oh. You just said nice for me. Side bags. Side bags. <laughs> bag tag hey. races. Now we're seeing who can do it fastest. This whole bag tag thing. Look. Yeah. It's It's hard to figure out. It's not user friendly. Oh. Making fun of dad earlier because he took too long. But now I understand why. Oh no, 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 keep that back on there. This guy has to stay. Like, like this is what here. I think it your bag's not gonna make it. Here you go. This guy we keep and this guy goes. Technical, who said technical bro? There you go. How many people does it take? Two. Yeah, there you go. Pull that, this stays, that goes around your bag. There we go. All right, who's winning? Brennan! Okay, Katie, let's see if you can be flawless. Oh, Dad, you still have to do yours. Oh, a lot. All right, Katie. Oh, Dad, is it your turn? No, no I can be Katie. Okay, ready? Set, oh. We didn't get this before. Brennan, that's good, we didn't get that before. Uh-uh. Saw the bag tag. Okay, ready, go. Do you have the timer? Um, it's been a minute and 36 seconds already. Oh, that's your receipt. Seven. <laughs> In the interest of safety, I have to 
You have to get your, you should get your receipt. Katie, your turn. Let's see if Katie, she hasn't been paying attention the whole time. Let's see how long it takes Katie. Hey, your turn. Right over here. She's like, I just want to go so far and go to the I know. I'm so done with this. Let's see if she does it right. Okay, all right, she's cleared the first hurdle. <laughs> she placed her bag on sideways. Now she has to figure out the boarding pass, how to scan it in. The funny thing about this part is it's been different every single time we've done it, so we don't know exactly how we're supposed to scan it. Oh, oh Katie no. goes, passes with flying colors. What the heck, she wasn't oh. even paying attention. Oh, now, oh, she checks her phone to make sure she has the right song on. Very good. My gosh, right now she's in the lead. Oh, no, she's she's beating, yes, she is. She's beating everybody. This is the toughest part. This is the toughest part. That we'll see if she can. Uh, get this. Yeah, I don't know. I don't no. think she will either. Let's see. Right, Here comes the boarding pad or the yeah, bag, bag tag. Okay, this is where everybody gets confused. Huh? Bag tag. Bag tag. Bag tag. Confused. Everybody's confused. Everybody's watching to see what's gonna happen. Oh, oh, that's a problem. Oh, she's gonna. Oh, yeah. Uh oh. Uh oh. Her, her, her luggage is not gonna make it. That is the ultimate fail. <laughs> she can't hear us. She was in the lead. Check out the That's it. She's done. Oh no. All right, Katie Loss. Let's just hope that we see that bag in DC. Bye. All right, Katie. Sorry. You're you're an amazing. For hours now. Who has? Everybody. You're an amazing competitor. At least, at least me and Ryan placed. That's and, exactly. And, and me. Searches. Yes. Nice game. Nice game. game. Nice game. Nice game. <laughs> Have a good flight. Mm, let me smell it. Oh, I like it. It feels like summer. Where's Brennan? It's called Sun. Ryan, how you doing? You need some cologne? Yeah, I need some cologne. I need some Gucci cologne. Mm -hmm. I need Versace cologne. Versace? Where did Brennan go? He was over here trying something on. Did he go back? Only no. Only I mean, you can buy it yourself if you. No. Why not? It's expensive. You can go to a Bath and Body Works, get something freshy. Sure, it's like a pound and a half. I'll buy the next. No. Wait, I don't understand. What? So you have to spend hundred dollars. Oh, okay. Oh, but your sunglasses were ninety-eight. Ninety-eight. Oh no. Are you sure you don't want to do that? Oh. Uh, okay. Is there something I can buy for? Um, yeah. Oh. You guys are worried about peasant things like sunglasses. I'm intellectual. I'm worried about real things like watches. Oh, I see. Like real men have watches. You you actually already have a watch. Well, I have a smart watch. Yes. That's why I don't even look at the smart watches. I'm not looking at the Swatch smart watches. I'm not looking at the Citizen smart watches. I'm looking at the G Shop and oh, okay. the Citizen and the Hugo Boss. Oh, cute. Oh, I like it. I like the crown one. <gasps> Me too. Hugo? Yeah. Oh my god. It's a teapot, though. Cute. I don't know. Oh, it's a toughie. It's gonna be a toughie. If you guys don't know, I have this Pandora bracelet, and it looks like that one. And I have a bunch of charms on it, and my dad got it for me. And I have like charms on it from like places that I've been. And so I it's think it's appropriate. I, I hear you too. Let's see if we can get somebody over to help us. All right, Katie decided on the crown. Ooh, it's beautiful!
squishy piece. Okay. All right, I'll show you guys mine in just a second. So I will say that they, hold on a second here, I got a water, a wine. This is going to be chili con carne. This is my cucumber salad. This is some cheese with an incredible cheese with crackers. This is goo, this is gonna be my dessert. It's some type of silky chocolate and yazoo caramel ganache. That looks really good. All right, here we go. Yum. <laughs> very nice. It's, this box could have been served at that restaurant, right? It's a very fancy, fancy box. And this is my tea, and I take it with sugar. So there's the sugar I'm going to put in the tea. Let's see what they have for high tea. Oh, look how pretty. It's called Mile High Tea. That's so pretty. And it comes, I get a little sandwich. That looks good. And I think from what I, what I read on the menu, it's a mozzarella and tomato. And basil. Oh my goodness, look at this. How sweet. There's a knife. Strawberry preserves, I love it. Clotted cream, which I'm guessing now is butter. I'm pretty sure clotted cream is butter. I don't know why they don't call it butter. And a scone, how beautiful. So I'm going to enjoy my mile high tea. Looks like they already enjoyed their mile high tea. guys so we got home a little bit ago it's 10 I mean more than a little bit ago like six o'clock actually we've been home for four hours but we've been I took Brennan to water polo I went to my water polo meeting we played around with the kitties we did we, you did too Ryan you played with the kitties there we go Katie went to Molly's house I know oh, look at the baby boy all right, let's wrap up this day. Want to wrap up this day? Yeah. I'm exhausted because it's what you tell me. Instagram wanted to make a Ryan and the cats edit. I would do that. <laughs> <laughs> that means that'd you. That would be low key fire. That would be low key fire. Um, All right, Buggy, let's find it. What made you happy today? It's like two in the morning. Wait, 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3. It's three in the morning. It feels so we gotta go to bed. I know, it totally feels like three in the morning. Look like, at you're doing a good job like unpacking. On, on packing? Yeah. Yeah. Nice work. Yeah. Okay, what um, made you happy today? Oh yeah, I washed my jersey. Look at it, it's beautiful. I'm gonna wear it tomorrow. Oh good, I love it. Let me smell. Mmm, so. I always love smelling clean laundry. All right, Cheryl, what made you happy? So I can yeah, go to bed. It was, uh, Steve Charles home from England and uh, just being in England this morning was cool. Yeah, crazy to think that, right? Just like waking up in England and sleeping in America. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah. All right, good night, James. I love you. And taking the shower because I know it's going to be good. Okay, bye. All right, let's go find out from Brennan what made him happy today. Here we come, Brennan. Huh? We're coming in, okay? Here he is, buddy. What's up? Nice job doing your homework. What made you happy today? Uh, coming home and it being warm. Yeah. Nice outside and all the flowers blooming. Yeah, it was very beautiful driving in, wasn't it? Springtime. It is. Oh, that's nice, babe. And go back to 
Fabulous. All right. That's Good night, streams. I love you. Good. Look at all that homework you did. I'm so proud of you. Hey guys, I took a shower. Feeling good and fun and fresh because I had a long flight on the way home and then I felt disgusting and then I went to Molly's and then I still felt disgusting and then I came home and I showered and I feel so much better. Me and Molly were talking about this. So we're gonna get, there's like this little sailboat called the Sunfish. Mm -hmm. And so they have one right now. And so Mr. Paul was like, what if we like make a thing like with the families, like where we both chip in and we get like a little like group of sunfish boats and we can like he can teach all the kids how to sail. And so me and Molly are gonna go sailing together and we decide that we're naming our two boats um, pasta and salad. <laughs> <laughs> like it's pasta salad. Because tonight we were eating pasta and salad and um, we were trying Oh that is disgusting. Whoops. Can you, I don't even think you can see that. Oh. That's disgusting. Okay. All right, I'll turn the light Ew. off. Ew. I'm gonna turn the light off in my room so none of them go in there. That's a good idea. That's so crusty. That's so gross. Because, uh, wow. Wow. This is, this is a look. This is a really good. Um. Oh, that's so gross. So out there, the only light in this area at all is that one right there outside of our door. And so all the bugs decide they wanna like swat up like right outside our <laughs> light. And so when we open the door, they all come in here because there's lights in here and then we end up with that, <sighs> which is absolutely disgusting. So yeah, anyway, me and Molly are gonna have tailboats named pasta and salad. Either that or, um, either that or steak. Mm -hmm. No, what did we decide? Uh, no, beef sirloin. Oh, what was it? Beef what is it called? What is it called? Beef? Beef sirloin? Yes. <laughs> beef and sirloin? Yes. That's so bizarre. Yeah. Okay. How about sun and fish? That's what I said. Yeah. And they like, look at sunfish. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be yeah. funny. Yeah. That's a good idea though. We should talk to him about doing that. Yes. Please talk to him about that because I really want to learn how to sail. I also need to get my boat's license. Okay. Comment below what you guys have today and we'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.